and we're back with Let's Play Broken Sword Shadow of the Templars Director's Cut. Where we left off, we had just found out about it the killer. Of the man we suspect. And now we're off to do stuff. Um, I'm thinking we need to go to... Uh, how about... La Rise du Monde. Right, I'm really, really bad at French. Let's talk to this guy. Excuse me. Bonjour, monsieur. Please, come in. Welcome. He in sounds more Russian-ish. Slavic. Walls, fantasy is king. Uh, I don't want a costume. Didn't you ever dress up when you were a child? <laughs> Not that I remember. Incredible. You'll be telling me next that you never shared your elder sister's lingerie. <laughs> I don't have a sister. Do what? And I think I'd look pretty silly in a brazier. I just need some information. Of course. How can I help you? Help. He really does sound like Slavic, not French. Anyway, um. Do you want this red nose back? Not after it's been worn, thank you. <laughs> does this dirty tissue mean anything to you? Hmm. Let me smell. That. Wait, what? That's disgusting. Best Imer's number seven, white pancake. Theatrical grease paint, right? You, what? Oui, monsieur. La creme de la creme of Cespian accoutrement. Have you really? seen any of it recently? Yes. Two can. Hmm. Do you recognize this man? Ah oui, he was here this morning. That is the man to whom I sold the grease paint. Ah. I remember the scar on his face. He chose two costumes, Bozo the Clown and Seamus the Pixie. A pixie? The pixie? Very smart. Really? Green silk with a taffeta lining. He gave me his name as Monsieur Khan. Khan! Khan! Now that we've got our... Have you heard of a man named uh, Plantile? I do Khan! not recall oh, any one of that name. Okay. Thanks for your well. help, buddy. My pleasure, monsieur. Allow me to shake you by the hand. Huh? Mm -hmm. uh, well, okay. <laughs> Joy buzzer. What are you trying to do? Kill me? You did not find it <laughs> I never saw the Evil funny look. side of electroshock therapy. Eh bien, it is yours to keep. A gift? Ah. Do I need a light? That might come in handy. No, but I give you a word of warning, monsieur. What? Remember to switch it off before you visit the toilet. Well, that that would be pretty interesting now, wouldn't it? Um Okay, never mind. Let's see what this does. <laughs> it plays Chopin's funeral march. That's interesting. Dun, 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 dun. Um, I think we should go back here. Fell the kicks and the giggles. It was just some police paperwork, a search warrant. Hmm. I'm gonna save it. To eight saves. Let's talk to this guy. Sergeant Moo? Ah, Monsieur Stobart, n'est-ce pas? That's correct. You remember me. The retention of such data is part of my duty as a gendarme. That is our crime is fought through attention to detail, not intuition. Yes, yeah, sure. Right. Anyway. Do you know a man named Khan? He's a shifty looking guy with a scar on his right cheek. No, Monsieur. Has this man any connection with the bombing of the cafe? Yes. I believe Khan was the name he used when he hired the clown costume. Hmm. Do you recognize the man in this photograph? No, monsieur. Okie dokie. It's the guy who bombed the cafe. The clown. This man looks nothing like a clown. He's uh. taken off his grease paint and costume. Then there is nothing to link this man with the killing. Nothing? Look at those murderous eyes. Hmm. <laughs> Hardly likely to get him convicted. He has a point there, though. 
Do you recognize this dirty tissue? No, monsieur, I do not. I found it in the sewer. Perhaps it would be better if you put it back there. <laughs> no way. This could be an important clue. If you say so, monsieur. Is Rosso here? Yes, he is. You wish to speak to him? Eh, why not? Yes, I do. One moment, monsieur. Why not? Might as well, huh? It's Tobak, monsieur. He insists on talking to you again. Did he say what it was about? No, monsieur. Very well. <laughs> Very well. Hi, Inspector. Remember me? But of course, Mr. Stobard. My mind is a well-ordered faculty. <laughs> a mental classification system that's the envy of the Bibliothèque Nationale. No tricks, mark you, monsieur. Just exercise. Just as our muscles wait oh, through Lord. inactivity, so our minds... He decay. is the model but of humility, there is no isn't he? If only people would learn to exercise their wits daily. If Indeed. he was trying to impress me, it worked. <laughs> he was pompous and patronizing, but he had style. Eh bien, if you called about the bombing, you're too late. Investigations have been closed. Nani? But what? I've been taken off the case. What about the murder, the dead guy? It is out of my hands. That is completely ridiculous. Did you find out the ID of the guy who was killed in the explosion? I already knew who he was. Oh, really? I heard that the bomb victim's name was Plantow. Your sources are reliable. He was a big shot at the treasury, wasn't he? Maybe that's why you've been taken off the case. I'm sorry, monsieur. I cannot come in. Uh-huh. Pol politicking. Don't you want to know what I found out about the killer? I told you, monsieur, the case is closed. <laughs> I have washed my hands of the whole affair. Then I'll have to continue my investigations without your help. No. You must forget the business of the crown completely. Go back to being an ordinary tourist, Stobard. So long, Inspector. <laughs> All right. Would you like to shake my hand, Sergeant? Not while I'm on duty, monsieur. The gesture could be misconstrued. <laughs> Not in America, but... I found this red nose in the sewer. What were you doing down there? Fishing for clues. That's where the clown went. You still insist you saw a clown, monsieur? Of course. And this novelty nose proves it. It will take more than a plastic proboscis to convince Inspector <laughs> Rousseau. You don't want this as evidence, then? Certainly not, monsieur. Fine, then. See you later, Sergeant. I'm going to leave. I don't know what I'm going to do, though. Let's see here. Um... No, wait, wrong way. Let's try Rue Jolie again. Back in Nico's apartment. Hi! Oh, hello. Hi! <laughs> the guy at the novelty shop gave me this. What is it? A hand buzzer. You put it in your hand and give people electric shocks. Why? It's a gag. A practical joke. <laughs> If you ever use it on me, I'll break your arm. Okay, well, okay. I get the picture. That's a wonderful sentiment. I okay. have to... G okay. Well, let me see if I can figure out what I need to do from now on here. Hang on a second. Hmm, it is beginning to look like a cover-up, isn't it? Alright, well... Maybe... Maybe we have to go back to the Chateau de la Vette. Well, whatever it is. Hi there, this remember guy. me? Ah, mais oui, Inspector. Have you found him? No, Who? not yet. The man in the sewer, of course. I'm, uh, sifting through the evidence. Ah, uh, rather you than me, monsieur. <laughs> so, uh... Uh, when you are not uh, exploring sewers, uh, what do you do? I take a lot of showers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 very good, monsieur. <laughs> a policeman with a sense of humor. Anyway. Hi there, remember? Huh? Who? I'm... Never mind. I... Hmm.
try uh, this guy again. Todrick. Hello? Mr. Oh, it's you. The man I'm looking for is called Khan. Khan! You bought a suit from me, remember? Mr. Khan. Yes, I remember him. Yes, I delivered the suit to his hotel. The Hotel Ubu. Uh, I uh, don't remember the room number. It was upstairs. The second room on the right-hand side of the corridor. Thanks, Todrick. That's all I wanted to know. Uh -huh. Now I've got you, Mr. Clown. Ha-ha! Well, now that we have that little piece of information, I'm actually going to go ahead and cut the video off, and the next time... Uh, in, in the next video, we will go after Khan. Until then, folks. <laughs>